Hello everybody, I'm Justin Webb. Um, sorry I'm late to the party. I'm trying to get everything organized on Canva and get everything set up. But uh, but I finally got it all worked out. And so um, uh, I'm Justin Webb. I'm from Arlington, Tennessee. That's where I reside right now. Um, I was born and raised in Memphis. Um, a little bit about my family. I have uh, eight siblings, including me, uh, one sister and six brothers. Um, it's, it gets pretty hectic sometimes, but I wouldn't change it for the world. Um, a little bit about my, uh, physical ed class back in the day, back in high school. Um, for the most part, my middle and high school both seem to be very, I remember them very well. Um, they're very structured. They're very organized. Um, all the physical ed teachers that I had, uh, they really knew their information well. And when they taught, they taught very well. And uh, it was very informal when um, their lesson plans were very planned out. And there's never a time where I, we went in and it, there wasn't anything planned. And, you know, we had a free time there. It was very rare for us to get a free time to just kind of like play basketball or something like that. So um, for the most part, I would say that I had a very great experience through high school and, and middle school with that. And uh, if I had to change anything about it, I feel like the one thing I would change is just kind of, um, how long each of those lessons took for because for the most part I remember very specifically that um, there would be times where we would do like a basketball like a unit and it would take us you know two weeks to learn how to dribble shoot and do all the stuff that you could probably put into one week you know and, and do over the span of one week and so, if anything, I would just change that and just kind of shorten down the length of time it, you would teach, like dribbling and basketball, especially or dribbling and shooting, especially because like in the classes that I had, I had very, I went to a very small high school and middle school, so um, the classes weren't that big to where you had to really worry about that, and um, or like worry about everybody getting a chance to go and stuff. So um, that's one thing I would change, and um, so. And then um, why physical ed? Like for me, I grew up playing sports and, and I enjoyed it a lot and I enjoyed being out on the field or on the court. And um, a lot of the a lot of those physical ed teachers that I had were also my, my um, coaches as well. And uh, I just remember growing up, I feel like they had a, a very key role in how like molded me into being who I am today. And, and I looked up to them a lot. And so um, I just kind of saw that as, an opportunity for me once I got at the age where I was trying to decide what I wanted to do. Um, I just remember back to that and, and always thought that that's what I would want to do. So, um, so yeah, that was kind of the main reason. And I went to college and got my bachelor's for kinesiology with a, with a minor in education. And that's what I kind of hope to get from these classes and this master's program is more the, the physical ed side and, um, not so much like the kinesiology side because I kind of, I understand a lot more of the kinesi, kines side, but, um, I only got a little bit, got to touch on a few things on the education side. So that's why like, I'm excited to be in this class and be, um, getting to just learn some new stuff that I can also incorporate into like my future classes and my future and future times with like in the gym and stuff like that. And so, um, yeah, I'm excited. Some technology that I've seen, is um uh there's a lot of apps out there today that uh like a coach could use or physical ed teacher could use that um could measure like bmi or like do certain like uh, labs with the kids that kind of gets them more interacting with like the kinesiology side just from what like we've used in like my classes at like back in my kinesiology classes a lot of that stuff you could also incorporate into like a high school um classroom as well and uh so i feel like a lot of like you could use the calorie counter app to like do um like cool little things where like throughout the week they count their calories or you know you could do um anything in that in that realm so i feel like there's a lot of like stuff out there like apps that you a uh, teacher or physical ed teacher could use um to to and like incorporate in their lesson plans to um get that get their like you know kind of bring more uh bring more um excitement to like it's not just like throwing a ball out there and letting them go and have free time but like letting them learn more about like you know how the body works how the movement of the body is and stuff like that so 
yeah, I'm excited about being in this class and uh, I, I look forward to all the future stuff that comes with it. So.